When I went to Japan before the pandemic, I learned so much about that country's history, culture, and the people. And I found some curiosities along the way, including the most unusual artwork. We're talking about street art that is found on just about every street. To see the wonders of Japan, you usually have to look up. But if you do that long enough, you'll miss the curiosities that most folks step over every day. Yeah, yeah. They're great, aren't they? The street art designs vary by city. And they use it to symbolize something historically or culturally significant. This is nice. It's simple, but some of them are really quite intricate in their design. There are hundreds of different manhole covers, and no one knows them better than this guy. He's not alone. There's a legion of fans called Drain Spotters. I am a manholder. I think they're kind of weird. Manhole geek, geek, yes, geek. <laughs> The self-proclaimed manhole geek travels all over Japan to photograph different manholes. Not everyone understands the obsession. <laughs> yeah, um, but it's an art form, you know. So all, all, you know, take off my hat to them. Kudos to them. I learned the life of a manhole begins here at the Nagashima Foundry. Artists work with cities across the country to create a variety of designs. The work is hard, hot, and requires an artistic flair. The foundry pumps out hundreds of manholes every day. The end result is a national obsession. Websites, Facebook pages, even a manholer convention. And this water circulation center showcases dozens of manholes. And did we mention the trading cards? I've never heard of it. Trading cards containing manholes, really? That's right. Fans collect them, but to get them all, you have to visit each municipality. How about 200? You have 200? 200. Okay, how many total are there? So about 600. 600? Yes, okay. about 600. So you still have more to collect? <laughs> yeah, I mean, of course. It's a Japanese curiosity. I mean, I've lived here 18 years, and there's still things I find out new every day. So if you ever visit Japan, enjoy the iconic places and the cultural must-see locations. But don't forget to look down. It's a country full of surprises. Because some of the best pieces of art are at your feet. Wow, I was impressed. I thought, what a fantastic thing.